Hi, this is Jody Yosofsky with Utah Key Real Estate. Thanks for coming back to my blog. Today we're going to do a quick uh, market snapshot economic update year to date and see if we can read the future a little bit, see what's coming down the pipeline in 2016. Okay, so before we get started, we have a few housekeeping items I want to take care of quickly. If you're curious what your home is worth in today's market, please click the link right over here. If you would like to search all the homes active on the MLS, please click the link right over here. Okay, so this week I attended a broker town hall meeting at the Salt Lake Board of Realtors and um, they bring in experts for this as always. I learned a few interesting things. I learned a lot of interesting things, but I'm trying to curtail this down to just a few minutes to what I think would be relevant to you guys as the consumers and the average Utah residents. So overall, Utah is doing spectacular compared to the rest of the nation. As far as job growth and unemployment, Utah's unemployment rate is currently 3.7. That's as of the end of September. And nationally, we're at 5%. So we're under the national average that way. And um, our report card, the rest through job growth, income increasing, everything like that, we got straight A's. Uh, we are in the top one, two or three states for everything across the board there. So that's all great. We've got big companies coming to Utah. I learned an interesting thing that we are eighth or ninth now I can't remember where my stat is, eighth or ninth in the nation for um, exporting. And um, that's a big industry for us as a state. And I learned the top five countries that we export to from Utah, which I thought was very interesting. The number one being um, UK, number two, Hong Kong, number three, Canada, number four, Mexico, and number five, China. So they talked a little bit about when the dollar is strong, that becomes a little bit trickier. Um, and the dollar is strong right now, which is great for many other industries. So that's a quick little update on that stuff. Um, something to keep in mind, everyone keeps talking about the election. There's an election every four years and the real estate market does not crash every four years. So please keep that in mind when you're um, contemplating whether now is the time for a move for you. The one thing they, they hammered a lot is interest rates are ridiculously low and the feds want so badly to raise those rates and it's again predicted to be uh, pretty likely that they will raise the rates in december so if you're thinking of doing a refinance or a purchase or something like that um, now is definitely a great time to consider that because it's quite possible if the feds can see it all possible they will be raising rates in december um, any other questions or you guys want to discuss this further, you know how to find me. Please give me a call or you can send me an email, jody at alwayscalledjody.com, and I look forward to seeing you out there.